ladies and elephants. My name is Billy, and I like poop. No, just kidding. <laughs> of course, I'm just kidding. My name is Bobby, and I like poop. And today, we'll be playing the part that I dislike the most in the game. Because it's very difficult not to die. And yeah, welcome to the eighth episode of my Thumb of Horror playthrough. Lean back and enjoy my death. All right, we're new in this area, huh? We just came in and conveniently closed the, the fence behind us so we can't leave. That's like what I always do. If I go into a dangerous place, I go in and then I completely lock the exit without being able to leave. That's what I do. I think it's the safest, the safest thing to do. Okay, here it's very dangerous. It's dangerous. We, if we go in, if we go in here, we die. Okay, I just want you to know if you go in there, she will die. Wait, didn't she die in the last episode? Oh no, it was the the girl with the raincoat, the daughter of Isaac Faba. Faba. Isaac Faba. Oh, we got a statue here, huh? The sculpture is impressive. It is a man struggling with tentacles up his bum bum. On the facial expressions, you can recognize that he sort of likes it. All right, let me use my my legendary intelligence to get through this puzzle here. I've already done it once. There's there should be <clears throat> uh, there should be security cameras, but we can't look at them for some reason, huh? Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I don't remember. Uh, maybe you have to go up here first. No, computer says no. <laughs> Okay, I'm. Come on, I don't want to walk in there and then and um, dun, 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 dun. I don't want to walk in there and then die. Maybe the madness isn't here yet. The presence. Oh my God! Oh sweet, but Jesus, the presence. It's haunting us. Okay, we can't go up the ladder for some reason. I don't know why. Do we have to move this thing first? I don't want to die. I'm so young and beautiful. Oh, man. I hope I don't die. Oh, here's the monitors. Oh, the monitors. Yes. Shit. Where did that thing come from? Wait, did you see when I, when the camera angle changed, she became she became much quieter. Oh no! This is the shelves. All right, here's the camera. Camera number one. It shows you which sh which shelves uh, have a monster in them. And we can rotate. Oh, sweet Bechesus. Lord of the Bechesi. Okay. 
Hang on, that's the other side of the table. Alright. Gotta memorize this. Uh oh, Spaghettio! Okay, okay, we don't want to go in there. Don't want to go in there. Oh man, oh lord. Oh, that's a safe. That is safe. It's not a safe, it's like... Don't want to go in there. Get a sign. Last one. I can go in the back of the table. Here's also safe. All right. All righty then. Oh, now we can go up. It was unclimbable. Just unclimbable. Until we walked between the shelves, and then it became so much climbable. I think we're safe here at the top, if I remember correctly, huh? Top is safe, the bottom is double plus unsafe. Could you not, not make any noises? Thank you. Thank you for the music and keep on playing. I can't move it from here. Okay, we gotta go. There was that. What was that? That shadow. A shadow. We shadow lunged at us from over yonder. Thank you for the music. Keep on playing. Oh, we got a note. <sighs> Wait, is there a first part? No. In which Aten was typically depicted as a sun disk emanating a radial series of arms ending in hands. That's like an Egyptian god, wasn't it? Oh yeah, each hand held an egg. Symbol of life. Do 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 do. I cannot. Alright, that's extremely interesting. Now we know everything. Plot twist. Yada yada. Bibbidi babbidi boo. And that's the story. Wait, why did this cut off? Omar laughs at me for not knowing that this painting was of Ivan the Terrible. What the hell was that? Okay, this is dangerous. The dangerous. Oh no. Oh sweet but Jesus. Sweet, but Jesus of but Jesus, but Jesus, but Jesus, but Jesus. Okay, now we have to use our our stupid little head. Try to remember, remember, remember the hands in November. Oh, thank God. Is this? It's not a thing to pick up, right? Yeah, this is not it, by the way. This is just the preparation. 
We gotta put down the thing. You know the thing? This one. We gotta put it off. I mean on, sorry. <laughs> we gotta put it on. We gotta do the thing, you know? The thing. The thing is on. Um, now I have to check the monitors again. Can you put the ladder down, girl? Girl? You have to go back the same way. That's so annoying. Maybe there's a lever here that lowers the ladder. Of course there isn't. But of course there isn't, young lady. You need to go back the way you came. Hmm? And you better make no mistake, otherwise the hands are gonna come. Oh, she put it. Okay. Oh, this is... This is fine. Actually better. Because I already forgot the way. No, I'm just kidding. Of course I didn't forget the way. Imagine forgetting taking two turns. Uh, uh, okay. First, first I go left and then, uh, I forgot. Okay, now we got the other monitor on. We gotta, we gotta memorize everything again, okay? Okay. This is the book. The right on the book. Basically. Camera move. The mouse controls are kind of of fidgety, of fidgety, of finicky, the kind of. Yeah, you don't you don't want to sit in that chair with the things behind you. You don't want to do that. They, they're gonna grab you by your bum bum. And then you're gonna pull you into the darkness with lots of hands, lots and lots of hands and tentacles. Doing the big nasty to you. Again, if we, if at this point you're wondering, huh, today's episode is particularly insane, then I have to tell you, it's almost empty. The big nasty. It's a miracle I didn't have to burp yet. Okay, table. That's the table with the book, isn't it? All right, I think I got it in my two thousand IQ brain. Skip it, girl. Bum 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 bum. You're gonna be a corpse soon. Excuse me, sir. Do you know the way? Oh, it's not a sir. It's just an empty armor. Oh, sweet, but Jesus. What to do I do? Alright. I think I need to grab another. A beer. I think this is the correct way. Please, Lord. Don't let me be misunderstood. Bada 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 ba. Da 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 da. Di da di da di da di. Oh, please don't die.
come on. Please don't kill me. Please do not kill me. I'm that just... must be Professor Oh Asher's my desk. god. All right. A little just girl. a little more. It's the Necronomicon. Kalatu. Varata. No. <laughs> it didn't work. Whew. Sheesh. Natura tenebrosa. Edgar Ordels. Okay, this is... We're too stupid to open books in this... In this game. We can just look at them from the outside. Oh, shit, I'm getting out of here. Oh, now you can just run. There was another book about Argos the Grant in the library. Now she can just run out. Of research trips written by two of his associates in the early 1900s. Sinister Nature was a kind of narration uh, of his frustrated trips in search of paranoia phenomena. With one of the last pages marked by Husha, the cursed counts in St. Cecilia's Abbey. St. Cecilia, the patron saint of music. I'm not sure what Husha wanted. The patron saint of salami. Steps, or how long he planned on doing it. But it was a start. The best place. I think we're going to go to chapter four, which is pretty awesome. Right? Chapter four, please. Oh, no, we're gonna... Okay. Shh. The day before. Literally the day before. Okay, this is the... This is Mr. Usher, huh? Sebastian. It's a Sebastian. And it's still the same episode. Oh, wait. This is the... Uh, the third episode, and this is the basically the fourth chapter of the third episode. Unbelievable. I'm gonna grab myself a beer. You don't go anywhere. Today, I will be having a fine glass of pale ale. Delicious. You know why they call it pale ale? Because it's pale and also an ale. Never say you never learn anything here. Because basically everything you've ever known, you learned it here. Cheers. Isaac, my dear friend, you don't know what you've done with that cursed music box. By the time you tried to warn me, we had all heard the music. Now I find myself trapped in a tragic race against time. I had a hunch. I thought that perhaps by returning the box to you, damn it. I've been such a fool. I lied, Isaac. I'm sorry. I just need you to hold on while I find a way to make things right. I left the house without telling Catherine. How could I possibly explain something like this? I thought she'd never believe me. And I was wrong. But now it's too late. I only hope you're all safe. And that you will find a way to forgive me. I must put an end to this once and for all. For my family, for you, and for my own sake. Argos Legrant. Everything revolves around that name. He was the person who had the box crafted and picked out the melody. I know he died in 1913. Newspapers of the day reported a violent burglary in his home. Everyone died, save for Ariadne, who was just a baby at the time. The case was closed, but something just doesn't add up. The police investigation was far too short-lived, and the bodies were not buried, but incinerated. I believe... I believe they were trying to hide the truth. I discovered that the book Natura Tenebrosa was written by two of Legrand's collaborators, the same two who followed him across Europe researching all matter of ridiculous legends, all equally far-fetched. The last case in the book speaks of Legrand's last journey. 
on which he embarked just before making the music box. I've followed in his footsteps for weeks now, <laughs> visiting every place, following every lead about that melody. Alas, I have reached the last leg of this journey in the north. Here we go. I found myself among the deserted ruins of St. Cecilia's Abbey, now covered in snow. Here, in 1912, the annual concert John of the patron saint of music was held. Legrand was not there at the time. Oh no. But he came they to played the song. soon after. Every single person who attended they did. that concert died or disappeared in mysterious <laughs> circumstances. And the abbey has been abandoned ever since. Why the don't their ears bleed instead of I their know eyes? There must be something here. A clue I can pursue. If not, I don't dare think about the future. I can barely distinguish what's real from what's not. Something is watching me. Following me, drawing closer and closer by the day. The melody still haunts me. Its the notes thing. echo constantly. That's in the my thing head. we saw in the with each passing minute. They in the library or whatever it was. And foreign. I see darkness all around me, and shadows lurking in the corners. I see my world merging with something else. I see another place. The black figure. I feel it's it's here with me. <gasps> Time to move. I have to find it. Okay, Queenie. Oh no, I forgot we have to listen to doors. I didn't do it for so long. Almost 30 minutes. No door listening. Now we're back. Oh, this is the stairs. I'm not sure if he can even get killed, actually. It's an interlude. Oh no, I didn't listen. Oh, thank God. Excuse them, what? Oh no, this is for the puzzle. For one of the puzzles. The remains have been here for decades. Well, I would I would look under it. You wanna see if it's a person or like maybe just you know potato bags or something? Arranged suspiciously. Oh no, it's the alchemy chamber. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to mix something here later. Not in this episode, though. I think the next episode plays here, too. I think the pressing the spring started the water flowing, but there's not enough getting through to move the bookshelf. <laughs> Excuse me. Dude, it's unbelievably hot. I was walking my dog today and I almost died in the sun. We try to be as much in the shadows as possible. But it's still extremely uncomfortable. It's like super sweaty. If super sweaty had a sun with super sticky, they would be me. But only later when my pants come off.
Uh, let's have a look at this place. Do we have a map? No. I think we get a map later. In the next episode. Yes, yes, yes. Oh no, I keep forgetting. Oh, here we go. The, it hasn't worked. The water isn't getting through to here. So we need to flippity flap the switches that are connected to the yellow pipe. Hiding spot under the table. Listen, I, I need to listen to at the doors again. I can't just walk through and feel safe because it's an interlude. It would be super frustrating if I still died here. That would be so annoying. So let's listen. Okay. Okay, kiddo. Nothing. I remember when I said nothing and then opened the door and died? <laughs> Have I laughed? I'm still laughing. And then I lost the other character because I lost the first character. Oh man, that was so joyous. There's something down here. Yeah, I think this is safe. I remember this. This would be usually something stupid in this game. You never know in these... Wait, let me, let me first see if I actually survive it. I do. As you can get easily killed. The plumbing system is extremely complicated for just a few toilets. Yeah, and it's like super small uh, pipes. I mean, if you if you squeeze a big fat log in into the toilet. I don't think I'll need anything this disgusting. Wait, he 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 pulls something out of the toilet with his bare hand. And then, after he's done that, the thing is too disgusting to keep. But his hand is like literally the same level of disgusting. At least compared to non-poop hands. To no poop hands. Kind of, huh. Suspicious. Flicked through the books before. We need a key here. Okay, mister. Oh. Oh, the game is frozen. And again. Oh, we're good. A hoe. Oh no. It's not the female type of hose. I would have liked one of those. <laughs> All the doors are locked. Fantastic. Oh sweet bejesus. This one? Also key. It's impossible without the key, you. No key, you no door. This one? Every door is jammed or locked. That is just not fair. That is just not fair. So we came in from here. I must have missed, um... Okay, I must have missed a pipe somewhere. Um, a, a lever for the pipes. All right. Okay, let's go through the rooms again. We can't do that enough. This is the lever that didn't work. It hasn't worked. The water isn't getting through to here. I guess we need to pull them in a certain order or something. All right, let's see. In here, there's a lever that can't be pulled. 
because the water isn't getting through. The watery water. There's no lever back here, right? It's just the complicated pipes. Oh, they got some books to read with their... With their crap smeared hands. And then they can put it, put it back in the shelf. There must be something behind that door. Dude, it's quieter behind the door than here. Go. If you die, I swear. And I swear by the moon and the stars and the sun that I will punch you if you die. Okay, we're still looking for... Oh yeah, all the other doors were, were, were closed, weren't they? Oh, maybe we can go to the center of this. What do we have here, Dimitri? Yuri Dimitri? Da. Da. I'm still damaged from playing Alexander in the first episode. I'm lang language jelly. Oh, if you're damaged from in a language perspective, how do you call it? You're language jelly damaged? You're verbally damaged, you're vocally damaged. You're damaged goods. There's nothing here, come on. We can't go to the center. There's a fence on all sides. So let me, let me clang my two high Q together. Come up with a solution. Wait, what is with her stick that she has? Use you! Dude, you can clearly step past these things. Well, not the Gramps McGrampington. He's too old for those shenanigans. Hmm. Alright, let's look at the doors again. Here we can use an item. Uh, the hole? I have no reason to use it. What is this? The fountain pen? <laughs> Can't open this either. Oh, with this one. It's pretty rusty, but still strong. Okay, it doesn't work on this door. This is where we came in. Wait, we can also use an object here. I don't think we can use it, open it with the pen. Maybe with the hole we can somehow force the door open. Right? Right, says Fred. Every door that has a queue will try it on. Oh! Okay, I don't know what he's doing. This is not how you open the door with a hoe. What are you doing? Are you insane? It's open! Oh, here we go. Watery water goes through the pipes. Does it go all the way up and open the little shelf door? Find out in the next episode. I hope we'll... F no, we'll find out in this episode, right? The pipe has been dripping for days. Oh, it's like my pipe. Oh, we gotta... Hang on, we gotta set of bellows nothing can't do we can just look at things C 
So, let me think. Now... We need to go... Do we need to go upstairs? Upstairs? Where's the upstairs? He has the same teeth as everyone else. The horse teeth. With lots of distance between every tooth. Lots of, lots of space between the teeth. Makes him look like the James Bond villain. You know, the one with the metal teeth that bites through... What was it? Uh, a sky car cable or something? Is this the stairs? Yes. Okay, please work. Please work. Work your booty, girl! Work your booty! Here I come. Ready or not? Is it open? Do we have to flip the flap to switch again? Okay, I have to go back down into the other room where I flipped the switch already. And it didn't do anything. Oh man, okay. Oh lord, oh man. Ah, that is annoying. The good old flip. Wait, through here we can't get, right? Without the key, we can't get. No key, no door. Okay, do you know how to walk downstairs? You put one foot in, in front of the other and you look in the direction where you want to go. It's very simple. Do it! Yes, to do it. So which was the, the, the rim with the other valve? I guess it was one without the can't get in symbol. Not this one. This one? No. It's a bit shabby. Wait, what does it say? But even I can't open it without the key. Wait, do we still have the hole? Oh, it's... it broke. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Please give me a... a little notification if it worked. And it doesn't tell me anything. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, perfect, thank you. Very good. Now let's make sure we don't get murdered. That would be disadvantageous. Mad! Wait, that was... Here. Stop it! Stop. Just go up the stairs! It feels us. It feels they're coming. It must be sensing that we're coming. Here we go. And the one, and a two, and a ding dang dong. Yes, yes. Open the door! Oh no, this looks like another complicated... Oh no, it's just a... What's what? this? Oh, it's a corpse. A mummy. But wait, why are there still insects here? If this is like... This can't be that long ago. 
there's still insects here because once it's gnawed clean the insects don't have to be here anymore there's nothing for them some days ago i now i observed the brothers performing a strange ritual they took turns to sit in front of a mirror and facing it light a lamp and then put it out this shall remain as written testimony of everything that has been discovered and that has been passed on to me, as it may prove valuable to whomever finds it. Sitting in front of the mirror, they observe their own reflection and everything behind them. Then they proceed to put the lamp out or dim its flame to the point that the eyes blinded by the previous glow no longer see. Thereupon, they light it once more and again observe their reflections and everything behind them, repeating the process several times. And sometimes, God help us, the reflection shown in the mirror isn't what it should be. I can't begin to describe the horrors that appear. The mere act of committing them to paper is an insult to our Lord. But what I can say is the more frequently these horrors appear, the closer they are and the less time we have until... Until... <gasps> <laughs> until they're no longer only in the reflection. Remarks made by the prior. That was the prior, wasn't it? He's doing the monster mash. Oh no, people hung themselves here. Well, gentlemen. To life. You gotta drink it if you have it. No, seriously, if you have it, you gotta drink it. Safe? The mirrors are cracked again here. The mirror is broken, but I see parts of it reflected, reflected like a mosaic. <laughs> Stupid comet. What? It describes to me what a broken mirror looks like. I can see it. You're showing it to me. Oh my god. Ripping salami. Careful. Safe. Oh, this is must be one of the monk monks' rooms. The wall has been covered in crosses. How oh, sweet Jesus. Help us with these monstrosities. Oh, look, he hung crosses from the ceiling, too. Oh, there's going to be hands from one of these, aren't there, at some point? What is this? If oh, the mix. Let's see how much I have left. The mirror game. Oh, my God. Oh no. 